this is my Savage Stevens 320 12 gauge technical it's basically a stock 12 gauge $199 Walmart shotgun I uh, taped off the trigger underneath took off the butt cushion taped that off and I'm about to do some uh, band inspired camouflage using four colors first color is that have a grape second color this green we have some accent colors fuchsia pink and another green so I'm going to incorporate these four colors onto this shotgun wish me luck so I've taken a piece of Dollar Tree foam board and just cut out a random wavy shape to use as a mask hold this up in different areas different ways and spray move it spray move it spray we'll do one color at a time layer them over each other the first color is going to be this high gloss which is going to take forever to dry tropical leaf so i'm going to dust that just do one side of the gun in the top let it dry flip it over do the other side and then repeat that process using the same template with different colors so here we go okay i got the first coat on and here it is kind of screwed up a little bit touched it i'm gonna let this dry and i'll flip it over and do the other side and it'll, this is the first layer, so it's really not going to matter that much. And here's the other side. Splattered a little bit, but no problem. I went around the top edge as well, best I could. Faded her in at the bottom. So there we are. Let that dry, and then the next coat. And by the way, I did totally decrease the thing before I sprayed it. The okay, next color I'm going to use is this uh, satin fuchsia pink, I guess. Uh, it should dry a little quicker. Got a new pattern cut just out of a piece of cardboard just to get some random shapes there. And uh, as soon as the first coat dries, Second coat will go. The first side done. <laughs> yeah, it's a funky color. A little bit up there on the barrel. A lot of that will get covered up though. Alright, let this dry. Do the other side. Here's the other side. On to the next. Okay, the third coat. Huh. Uh, for the other side.
There's a little shot of it finished. Came out pretty funky. Digging that back thing right there. Rubber. And turn it around this way. I mean, no, it's not perfect. But it does look pretty cool. And I may put a satin finish over top of the whole thing. But it ain't too bad. So, that's it!